Alrighty, so, um, yeah, boss locations, right. Let's get right into it, because I'm... I need the drops. Okay, so first of all, we're going to go with one of the most important bosses, Rock Cardinal. Uh, my main reason for saying that's most important is definitely because of its drop. The Scythe, even if you don't, even if you're not a physical main, you'll still be able to hit a lot and deal a lot of damage. Alrighty, um, let's just attack him right off the bat, because we want to get this done as fast as we can. Also, he's going to attack us right off the spawn, by the way. At least he's trying to, so while he's stuck down there, because he can't get up to here because it's a, you know, fat thing in the road, um, we'll just apply every single buff that we have in stock. Alright. I might turn a bit further away because my mic is in a different location as to my, well, where I'm facing, but hopefully it's good. I've been playing so many different flipping games. Like, I've been playing different games, right, but they all require different ways to run different buttons to run so it's all so weird i'm so used to different keybinds now <laughs> me instantly trying there we go oh i really want to replace my neck twister with the grab move because it's just gonna be a whole lot better Grab moves like it's weird to hear it sometimes. That's why I prefer to just yeet him across the map. Try to apply some stacks. Even though I've already got it equipped, I, it just lets me reapply it so I don't have to worry about it running out. Down, Bakaruski. Oh no. Fucking you, I'm stuck under the ground. No! Oh, I would have gotten out of that too. I perfect dashed it up and everything, but nah. Nah, the floor. I do I at least have two seconds. You know what, Rika? In his own domain! <laughs> yes. See, this is what you can do if you have a Rika on your side. On cam. Trying to get my transfiguration all the way to 100. I'm still stuck here. Can I get out of here? I got out! <laughs> Oh, the sheer spamming I had to do. Oh. Imagine we get the curse. Imagine we... Ooh, ooh possible. It's, I mean, it's possible. The annoying thing is when there are a bunch of chests next to each other, you can't tell if they're legendary because it doesn't show the red light unless it's very few. You kind of... I have more than one legendary, of course. So, um, see, told you. Uh, hoping... Uh, the good thing is even if they're red, it doesn't... It means that there's always going to be legendary, but if they're not red, it doesn't mean there's not going to be legendary. There's still, weirdly enough, I've gotten some legendaries from um, those before, so it definitely is a possibility. Now, sadly, it wasn't a possibility. That was some reason. The two things I want is the scythe, and then I also want the dragon bone. Anyway, so that's the first location. If you're not high enough level, by the way, okay, so you teleport to them, just teleport to the rot, uh, archbishops, and he... Yeah, if you just follow, you just go just past him. He's just over the hill past him, so. <laughs> he's like right next. <laughs> he's he's behind the big wall on the other side of the archbishops. You know what I mean? It was just opposite to the archbishops. That's pretty much it. Now you won't, yeah. I don't know, it's very weird because when you're there and you don't actually think about it, it just looks like a normal wall, but you can actually just jump over it. All right, and our next idea, or our, sorry, not idea, our next quest will be to fight. You know, we'll do the volcano deity, then we'll do the ruin guardian. Okay, now the Volcano Deity, I've done a video on that. I've also done a video on the Rock Cardinal. But I decided to pull the boss in one video just to make it a lot easier. Now, boom, 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 boom. These are what you get. So you can get Gomu Punches. <laughs> Pretty much what it is. Or you can get this. So you can just use this normal, normal on the ground. Or you can just use this to just get yourself on the ground. I use it for escaping air combos, okay? Gets me of air combos or if a bunch of enemies are right below me, I'll do that. It does a fair amount of damage from me not having anything really in strength apart from like 50. But it is very good. 
that resets are very easy to get so you're, you're fine using them however the hell you think you want to use them now we're gonna need to swap this with neck twister why have i just swapped two abilities um i prefer to yeet him than to just hold him still because the thing is that thing has a small aoe so it just you know just makes it easier on me i can just grab him if he gets too close get out of combos no it's a nice little combo escape ready Yes, I am being a prolific a hat to the boss. Why? Because I can. Okay. Yes, messing up Rika. Rika should do more damage. That 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 is really scary. Uh, he, yeah, it's Rika. Let's go. <laughs> I was like, no, he dodged it. No, no, Rika grabbed him. Rika was like, nah, yeah, I'm moving. Once you get the 500 of a mastery, it allows you to get the 10% extra damage buff, which is what I'm going for. I uh, transfiguration so that I can do a bit more damage um, with my spores. Gives me a reason to actually apply it, you know what I mean? Yeah, I knew that was what I was going to could see the glow at the start if you go back. Alrighty, now hopefully, I mean, we don't really need the curse shots. Or the only thing I wouldn't mind is Toji's pants. So like the curse ingot, the, not the curse ingot. Sorry, the the curse drop ingot that you get, which I'll show you actually. Um, it allows you to craft it. So if I just go to uh, curse, no, if I just go to material, I only have one of it. So blood still ingot. Yeah, it is. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh, clicking and to teleport. What am I doing? Many other games, eh? I've been cheating on Jutsu Infinite. <laughs> Ready? We're in Guardian. Here we go. Beautiful. Now, this guy's one of the easiest bosses you'll find. You'll kind of find. But he does. He is one of the most rewarding. As well as he drops less chests as well. So he's very, um, very hard to get dropped. I'm about to go all out in the days. What's wrong, Rika? <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Bo -do 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 -do. Uh, as you can see, though, uh, what we'll do is we'll have Rika. Uh, drops three chests. You suddenly drop two to one, which is kind of sad. Um, I don't believe that they're guaranteed to be legendary, so that is a that's that's a very very sad part as well. But apart from that, yeah. Those are pretty much all gonna well, those are pretty much all the you know boss spawns. Took us a minute to find them all, but you know. Uh so yeah, Rune Guardian, just go to the lake for that. Volcano DT, just go to any of the magma curses, okay? They're all those two are starting level. You know, you, you can do that from like your like from prestige zero to next i'm sorry rank zero to your next rank so there's no prestiging um wave room should spawn right here but that's not really a boss but you know if you want to find boss shops that's another way anyway thank you for watching and i'll see you guys all later goodbye fuck out of here with all that bullshit